Hi children, how are you today? Welcome to another Fun Learning with Teacher Ira. This time we are going to learn about one very important lesson that is so relevant to us today. But before that, let me teach you a song. Okay, what do you do in the morning as you wake up? Do you wash your face? Do you brush your teeth? Do you take a bath? Do you comb your hair? Okay, let's sing that song, everybody. This is the way I wash my face, wash my face. Everybody, wash my face. This is the way I wash my face so early in the morning. Later, we will learn what do we use in washing our face. Okay, how about our teeth? This is the way I brush my teeth, brush my teeth, brush my teeth. This is the way I brush my teeth so early in the morning. You have to brush your teeth properly. You go up, down, up, down, and you brush even the inside, up there and down here, and even your tongue. Okay, how about your hair? This is the way I comb my hair, comb my hair, comb my hair. This is the way I comb my hair so early in the morning. Okay, this time, let us learn what do we use in making our body clean. Okay, let's go to that one. These are the things that make our body clean. What are these? Let us begin with our hair. What do we use to keep our hair clean and tangle-free? Okay, first we have here the shampoo and the conditioner. Do you use your shampoo and conditioner? Kids, the shampoo makes your hair clean. And the brush and the comb will keep your hair tangle-free. Okay, next is the teeth. What do we use for our teeth? Mm, of course, not pencil and not some other kind of things, but we use toothbrush and toothpaste. But kids, reminder, just a little amount of toothpaste. During the early times when they don't have toothpaste, they just use salt or a stem of guava tree. You know that? So we are blessed nowadays that we have toothpaste, but always remember that we should just use a little amount of it. Okay, next we have the ears. What do we use to clean our ears? Oh, don't use your pencil and don't put it here in your ears. You use the cotton buds. But please, children, don't push it so hard. Just the outside part of your ear. Okay, next is our nose. Okay, how do we keep our nose clean? Of course, especially now that we are having a pandemic called COVID-19 that is so dangerous for our health, we should always cover our nose, our mouth as well, with mask. Don't go outside, kids. And whenever you need to go outside, you always have to put on your mask for you to be protected from the virus. And when you have dirt in your nose, if you have... Um, something there, what do we use in cleaning it? Not anything else but a clean handkerchief or a clean towel. Okay, next, let's have our hands. How do we keep our hands clean? Okay, as it was directed by the Department of Health, we should always keep our hands clean by washing it thoroughly with clean water and soap. You may use singing of happy birthday song two times to keep it clean just make sure that your hands are clean don't eat with dirty hands whenever you touch something you wash your hands you may put on alcohol if you have okay and you use your towel to pat it dry now let's have the next one our nails let me see your nails are they long kids please keep it trimmed okay by using nail cutter not scissors not knife but nail cutter and ask help from your mom or anyone who is bigger than you okay don't bite your nails children because there are dirts in the nails that might go inside your stomach might make you sick okay so you will use nail cutter for your finger nails now, let me see if you got our lesson. Okay, what goes with a given body part? Let us try. With our hands. 
Is it soap or mask? What do you think? Whoop! Of course, the soap. Did you get it right? Great. How about with our nose? Is it hairbrush and comb or a mask? What's your answer? Correct. So it's a mask. How about with our ears? The cotton buds or brush and comb? Let's see. Yes. Are you correct? Great. So you will use your cotton buds, of course. How about for our teeth? Is it towel? You will just wipe it with towel if it's dirty? Or you use toothpaste and toothbrush? What's your answer? Let's see if it's correct. Is that your answer? Then you're correct. You should use toothpaste and toothbrush. How about for your hair? Of course, the shampoo, not the toothpaste for the hair. So you will use your shampoo. Okay, how about for our fingernails? Is it scissors or nail cutter? What's your answer? Great, so it's a nail cutter. Okay, great job, children. You did a good job today, and I hope you have learned something. Always remember, kid children, that you should always keep your whole body clean for you to be free from all kinds of viruses, for you to be free from all kinds of sickness. Bye! Thank you!